You fools. You are all wrong. Well, guys, this is part three of my three-part series of the camp story time, but that doesn't mean it's going to be the last story time. I loved making these. I'm going to continue making them, so there's going to be more. Don't worry, guys. But this, this exact story time that I've been telling you guys, oh my goodness, y'all have been enjoying it way too much. So again, this is part three. So if you haven't already watched the other two parts, go watch them now. They'll be in the, I'll put them in the description for you if something I don't forget. And if you guys are enjoyed story time and want to see more story time, go ahead and leave a like. Let's go for like, we hit 40 likes. Let's go for 50 likes on this video. If we could hit 50 likes. I will do whatever the most upvoted comment down below is, assuming it's not self-harmful or harmful of someone else. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let's just go ahead and get into this very interesting video. I actually have been dreading saying this part of the story because it is the most interesting of the three. It's definitely the most uh, cringe, most uh, I don't like it. I don't want it. But you know what? It is what it is. <laughs> uh. Alright guys, anyway, story. So this would have been on a Thursday night after everything's happened. We're getting ready to get into our cabins. And we're, you know, whatevering. And he's in the shower. And he starts singing this song that he, he can't... Okay, let me back up. Back up. He can't sing for the life of him. He's bad at singing. I'm sorry. He cannot sing. But he's trying to sing a song. And it's okay if you're a bad singer. You enjoy singing. That's fine. He didn't know the words. He did not know the words. He knew like the melody to it, but that was all he knew. That was it. And so we were all like, Zach, you don't know even, you don't even know what song you're singing. So stop singing it. Anyway, so I get out of the shower and go back. And then he comes back a couple minutes later, just there's nothing but a towel on. And we're like, okay, Sylvanix and myself are like, put some clothes on. You don't, don't have clothes on. Please put some clothes on. And he was like, fine, fine. So, you know, our eyes are covered. We're like, Zach, put clothes on. And, he, and we're like, are you done? He goes, yes, I'm done. I'm like, okay. I opened my eyes and I immediately went to take a blowtorch and burn him out because he wasn't done. And I was like, Zach, I was like, Zach, blah, blah, blah. And he goes, okay, I'm sorry. He's like laughing. thing. it's the funniest thing ever. And he goes, I'm done. So I look at him and he's not done, but he turns around, faces away from us, slaps his butt and goes, my back bongos. And I was like, what are you doing? Why do you do this? Like, why? And I was like, are you kidding me? Blah, blah, blah. So I cover my face again. So I can't look at him because I want to kill myself. And it just. Ugh. And then. I was dreading telling this story to all of you because I really didn't want to add this part in here. But I have to tell you guys the full story. So this is actually what happened. After just that, he turns around again to face us and starts going, my front bong. But as he's saying that, I take a water bottle. And I chucked it at him as hard as I could. I just threw it at him like, like really fast and really hard. Cause I was so sick and tired of him. It was just, <sighs> anyway, I hit him right there where you don't want to be hit. And it, it, I, and it, it was a, I was a good feeling to hit him. It really was. Cause he was just getting on my nerves. <sighs> I didn't like it. It just wasn't. <sighs> Uh, anyway, so on third on on this is on that was like Thursday. So Friday, they have a thing where it's like talent night, and basically you can go up, you can sing songs, you can just do kind of kind of whatever you want to do. And people do really dumb things like there's skits, things like that, and it's it's you know it's whatever. And so we hear is next up is gonna be Zach singing some song, some love song. I don't remember what it was called, but he he sang it regardless. And so he gets up there, he's so nervous, and he goes. Frozen. So well, he actually called our real names, but you know, he goes, Can you please come up here? And we're like, We face each other. And we're like, No, we're not going up there. And I'm like, I'm not going up there at all. I don't care what you say. I'm not going up there. And so we're like, No. And then he was like, Oh, okay, I guess I'll sing it alone. I'm like, yeah, because I'm not helping with this. I don't even know what song you're singing. No, and no, I'm not going to do it. So music starts playing and everyone's like, "Woo!" 
you know, because people like are trying to be nice or whatever, and they're like, woo, blah, blah, because like, as soon as the song starts, and then he goes to sing it, and this is pretty much what he does. All right, so, so, so this song is, is for P. I'm not going to say her name. We'll call her P. For P, and I really like you. I also like you. And then name, like, three of the girls. But we like you the most, P. And we're all, like, laughing because we're like, oh, my goodness. Did he actually just say that? And he goes... I've been practicing this every day in the shower for you so I can sing it to you tonight. And we're just like, <laughs> and it just was awful. And so instead of singing the song, this is what he does. He basically goes, <laughs> as it's like playing louder to it. So you can't even hear his voice. But you just hear him going, <laughs> and it's like, what? And it just, why? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? You don't. You don't do that. That's not a thing you do. I'm sorry. You just don't do it. Anyway, and then you have Saturday. Saturday, pretty much, all only thing that, like, big things that happened was he asked to take pictures with him. And we were like, okay, buddy. You know, like, uh, and that was it. And we were like, whatever. And then he goes, and can I have your phone number? That way we can talk until next year. And I'm like, no, you're not getting my number. I'm not giving you my phone number. And he's like, please, I just want to talk to you for all this. And I'm like, I was like, all right. And I gave him the completely wrong phone number and it was phenomenal. He has not messaged me since. Why? Because I didn't give him my real number and I'll never see him again because I grad I'm, I'm too old to go to the camp anyways. But uh, that is the story about Zach or what we call him Zach. It was an interesting story. I hope y'all really enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more story times, go ahead and make sure you leave a like 50 likes and I will do whatever the most upvoted comment has. So go down there, make sure you read the comments, upvote them. And another story time on Wednesday, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you are new and if you enjoyed these story times. And then I will talk to you all later. Out.